Hi there, Kat Lewis here. So today I'm sharing five work from home jobs where they provide training. For the most part, these are basic entry level positions. A couple of them do want you to have a little bit of experience, but I'll get into that when I get to those jobs. And you can earn anywhere from $15 on the low end all the way up to $32 on the high end with these positions. So if this interests you, let's jump right into them. So the first one comes to us from the company Hims and Hers. They're a telehealth company that sells prescription and over-the-counter medication. And right now they have an opening for a customer experience agent. This is a full-time remote position for anyone anywhere within the United States. And I'm going to scroll down this job lead. I want to see how much they pay. They tell us they'll pay between $19.50 and $23.50 per hour. And they'll provide training in this position. Right here they tell us they want you to be able to complete trainings and up trainings as needed. So this is your typical customer service position. You'll respond to customer inquiries across email, phone, chat, and proprietary messaging systems. You'll resolve issues in a personalized, accurate, and timely manner while building long-term relationships with customers. You'll become an expert in all the hims and hers products while maintaining the highest level of discretion while dealing with customer issues. You should be able to strive to meet and exceed structured performance targets, report on customer trends and feedbacks, and they expect you to be able to work overtime when needed. They'd like you to have at least two years of work experience, and that can be any kind of work experience. They'd also like you to have at least one year experience in a customer-facing support role. So if you ever worked with the public in any capacity, that qualifies. You're able to balance attention to detail with efficient execution in a fast-paced environment. You have excellent problem-solving and communication skills, and they'd like you to be able to work in multiple systems and successfully navigate multiple sources of information. You have strong writing, spelling, and grammar skills. You're able to work independently as well as with a team. And you're willing to work non-standard business hours, including weekends, evenings, and holidays when needed. So if this job interests you, this one will provide training and they'll pay between $19.50 and $23.50 per hour. Check out the link below for job number one. The second training provided work from home job I have is with United Health Group. They're looking for a payment variance specialist. This is a full-time remote position anywhere within the United States. And even though it says Dallas, Texas as the primary location, they confirm you can do this job anywhere within the United States. So you'll be working Mondays through Fridays from 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And you don't have to live in that time zone. Just translate your local hours to those hours. And they'll provide four weeks of paid training. And those training hours will be from 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Monday through Friday. And training will be done virtually from your own home. So I'm going to scroll down here. I want to see how much this job pays. And it looks like you can earn anywhere from $16.54 to $32.55 per hour. So what will you be doing in this position? In this role, you'll be part of the Accounts Receivable Division. You'll actively participate in team huddles and meetings by way of sharing knowledge, requesting information, and recommending process improvements. You'll do some problem solving with your peers and leaders to address payer underpayment and issues or changes that directly impact the accounts receivable. You'll resolve assigned accounts in a timely and accurate manner, take necessary AR adjustments in accordance with the department's adjustment policy, meet or exceed the EMHS performance standards, and review historical payment information to determine accuracy of reimbursement. You'll also review potential payment variances and identify true discrepancies, resolve payment disputes with payers, request relevant information from appropriate revenue cycle and clinical departments as required, and advise management of payment variance issues. You'll also maintain the knowledge of payer policies and ensure all functions related to underpayment support the team goal objectives as well as EMHS's financial performance objectives. To qualify for this position, you must be at least 18 years of age, and they'd like you to have at least one year knowledge of medical terminology, current procedural terminology, and international classification of diseases. So if you don't have that knowledge, I'll put a link in the description to a really good medical terminology resource. They'd also like you to have at least one year experience with payer regulations, principles of accounting, reimbursement concepts, and automated account receivable systems. And they'd like you to have at least one year experience working with overpayments related to government, commercial, and self-pay payers, as well as exposure to working with applicable regulatory guidelines related but not limited to Medicare and Medicaid programs. So if you don't have those few pieces of experience, if you're still interested in this job, I would definitely still apply for it because you probably have some experience doing accounts receivable, right? You've dealt with the bank before, you know how money goes into the bank, and it's pretty easy to pick up payment information related to Medicare and Medicaid. All you need to do is a quick internet search. 
they'd like you to be proficient with Microsoft Office applications, and you need to be able to work normal business hours between 8 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And again, you don't have to live in that time zone. And they tell us, depending on the business needs, you may need to work occasional overtime. And they prefer you have at least one year of healthcare under payments experience, as well as experience with Northern Light Health Patient Accounting Software. And those are just preferred, they're not required. So this is job number two. This one can pay anywhere from $16.54 up to $32.55 per hour. If you like this one, check out the link below for job number two. Okay, so I have another position with United Health Group where they'll train you. This is for a dental plan advisor representative. And even though it has Madison, Wisconsin as a primary location, you can do this job anywhere in the United States. This is a full-time work from home position. You'll be working Monday through Friday, eight hour shifts between the hours of 7 a.m. and 8 p.m. Central Standard Time. And you don't have to live in that time zone, just translate your local hours to those hours. And given the business needs, you may need to work occasional overtime. So they offer a five week training session. The hours will be from 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Central Standard Time, Monday through Friday. And training will be done virtually from your home. And I'm gonna scroll down here. I wanna see how much this job pays. They'll pay between $16.54 and $32.55 per hour. So you'll mainly be responsible for providing an exceptional customer service experience when responding to and resolving customer service inquiries and issues. You'll research complex issues such as medical, dental, flex spending, pharmacy, etc. across multiple databases and work with support resources to resolve customer issues and or partner with others to resolve escalated issues. You'll own the issues through resolution and apply creative solutions and effective problem-solving techniques to address members' needs. You'll educate the member on health incentives offered by their employer as well as all consumer-driven health products. You'll also educate the caller on the benefits of a primary care physician and help to ensure and educate that all preventative screenings have been completed. You'll intervene with care providers, which are doctor's offices, on the behalf of members to assist with appointment scheduling or other matters. Address complex issues with an awareness of when to refer complicated situations to various departments and translate healthcare related terms or terminology and complex processes into simple step-by-step -step instructions. They'd like you to have a high school diploma or a GED or at least 10 years of equivalent work experience. You must be at least 18 years of age and they'd like you to have at least one year of customer service experience in an office or professional setting. And of course, you need to be able to successfully complete your training and be able to work an eight hour shift between the hours of 7 a.m. and 8 p.m. Central Standard Time, as well as occasional overtime. So if you like this job, this one pays between $16.54 and $32.55 per hour. Check out the link below for job number three. InMotion Hosting, they're a well-known web hosting company. They're looking for a technical support specialist. This is a full-time remote position and they will provide great internal tools and trainings in this role. And I'm gonna scroll down a little bit. I wanna see how much they'll pay. They tell us they'll pay $18 an hour plus additional performance bonuses. So they're looking for a full-time technical support specialist to assist customers with any issues they may have with their web hosting services. You'll troubleshoot customers' technical problems through inbound calls, chats, and tickets. You'll learn from your peers and teach what you've learned to others in the collaborative environment. Walk customers through the setup of email, cPanel, and FTP clients. And you do all that while being 100% focused on helping customers, not relying on scripts. All they want is for you to have a willingness to learn and grow to higher level technical roles a helpful attitude, a friendly disposition. They'd like you to have knowledge of Linux, and that's pretty easy to pick up. All you need to do is a quick internet search for Linux. They'd like you to have technical problem solving skills and the ability to explain technical solutions in layman's terms. So if you're the go-to person whenever friends or family have computer related issues, I think that qualifies. They prefer you have experience creating or hosting websites and a working knowledge of cPanel. And they also prefer you have experience in a help desk or call center environment. And both of those are just preferred, they're not required. So remember this job pays $18 per hour. If this one interests you, check out the link below for job number four. The fifth and final work from home job that provides training is also with InMotion Hosting. This is for a customer service specialist. This is a full-time remote position anywhere within the United States. And I'm just gonna scroll down a little bit here. They tell us they'll give you opportunities for professional growth through career coaching, job shadowing, and company-wide trainings. And they'll pay $15 per hour plus additional performance bonuses. So this is your very bare bones, basic kind of customer service position. 
So over the phone, live chat, and email, you'll address incoming requests from new and existing customers related to billing, account management, and general customer service issues. You'll assist customers while expanding your technical knowledge. You'll utilize your technical problem solving and evaluation skills to assess customer needs, educate the customer about their account, and document interactions through contact tracking. So yeah, this is your bare bones customer service kind of position. They'd like you to have a passion for excellence with genuine care for customers. You have the ability to communicate clearly and professionally. You're able to resolve issues from customers and leave them with a positive experience. You should have a general technical aptitude and the interest in learning new technologies. They'd like you to have at least one year experience in a call center or help desk environment. Customer service retention or help desk capacity is preferred. And they also prefer you have experience creating or hosting websites. And those are just preferred, they're not required. So remember, this one pays $15 per hour. If you're interested in this entry level job that provides training, check out the link below for job number five. All right, there you go. We just went over five work from home jobs where they'll give you some training. I hope at least one of these works out for you. But if not, check out this video right here. Hopefully one of those will work for you. Good luck to all of you who apply. And as always, thank you so, so much for visiting and I'll meet you on the next job lead.